All right, this video is on grading in Schoology using your Mac or your desktop computer. So you wanna be logged into Schoology and um, you wanna click on the course that you wanna grade in and then um, you wanna find the assignment. So first off I have, um, I changed the due date of this assignment um, to Friday, August 13th, just so we could, um, I could show you what I am um, doing. So click on the actual assignment and on the very right is gonna be all your students that um, this one is submitted. If you go to this little drop down, you have options. You can, um, you can have, you can just see who's turned it in so that you've received. So I had 15 students in this class. Um, so 13 out of the 15 um, actually turned it in. Um, I graded all of them. So if you, let's say you only graded five, but you have eight more to do and you don't wanna see all of them, you could just click on the needs grading and just the students that you haven't graded yet um, will be there. You can, um, just grade your late students so i had nobody that turned it in late or you can just um, click on the students that are already graded or you can see who did not turn it in so which two students did not submit it okay um, some other information is for homework typically you have a due date so this is due friday august 13th 2021 um, everybody turned it in on time, so it's going to be green and say on time. If they turned it in late, it's going to, instead of it saying on time, it's going to say late. So, um, you know, if you have a policy where a student doesn't get full credit, if they turned in late, it's an easy way to see if they turned it in late. So I'm going to click on this student. All right, so here's um, this student's assignment, solving proportions, and um, here's where I put their grade in, five out of five. If you want to, you can um, leave a comment. So sometimes I'll say, um, if a student didn't show their work, please show, you, show your work, and you wanna click on show to students so that they can um, actually see it. And in another video, I'll show you how to sync your, um, Schoology and your Infinite Campus, and these um, comments actually get sent to campus. So your grades will get sent, and so will the comments, which is really nice. Okay, so if I did put a comment like show your work, which this student did great, so I wouldn't, um, please fix and resubmit. Um, then I'd click show to student, hit submit, and then when I send it over to campus they'll be able to see my comments okay um, some other things some other features is um, it's kind of awkward to use um, on a mac but you can you know if you want to draw a circle around something if you want to um, you can delete it if you want to um, highlight you can you know highlight a particular um, Part of the text if you want to um, if you want to leave a note for the student whoops you can do that as well like you know please um, add your name or if you're grading an English paper you could leave a comment like please use a proper ending to your sentence I don't know and there you go. So there's lots of features um, you can use with um, the grading piece. Um, and then once you're in here, you can just click this arrow and it'll go to the next student and the next student. And then you can just keep grading until you are finished. Um, if you do make a comment, right here all the students will be able to see it so if you want to make a comment about um, the assignment all students will be able to see